Welcome to the process, breaking up with your identity. We have an objective and two actions. First, we identify the roles and the attachments to your personal history. That's the point of this exercise. This process will dramatically increase your awareness and control over your thoughts. Step one, we're gonna identify the roles and the characters that you play in your life. For example, dad, mom, brother, sister, divorced man, broken man. So there's a difference between the role, if I'm, a, if I'm a husband, I'm playing a role, or an employee or a business owner is also a role. Now, a character might be, you know, the divorced, broken person, uh, struggling with finances, struggling with relationships, right? The character that you play in this movie of your life. Become aware if this identity supports who you are, as in your truth, or does it support what you have already manifested, which is just already done, it's in the past, and you're just looking at it again and again and again. So does it support the truth of who you are as an infinite being or just what's already manifested in your physical world? Then we wanna identify the thoughts that support the roles and the behavior, right? What are the thoughts behind these roles that you just identified? So there is a meaning behind them. We don't just do them because for no reason, they started for a reason. So we wanna look at what are the ideas and the thoughts that support the role and the behavior of what you're already playing. Does this role and behavior support the reality that you want to experience or does it support what you are observing? Is this who you wanna be or is this what is already manifested once again? When making choices and decisions, notice the thoughts in your head. Quickly acknowledge if they are familiar or new. Your body will answer this for you. Then choose to drop the story and the data that is your excuse to not choose the most empowering choice available to you. Now, think of what role and behavior will you choose in freedom to choose, such as loving like you'll never get hurt. So if you have excuses to not play big, excuses not to love like you're never gonna get hurt, this is where we've identified some old belief systems that are attached to the persona, the character that you're playing in your life or in your family structure. Once we identify those, we can then choose to drop them so that we can step into the freedom of who we truly are. For example, loving like you will never get hurt. 